Hello again. On one of my early morning walks during the summer, I came across what I call a prophetic picture. Allow me to try to paint the picture I saw before we look at a possible interpretation. I was walking towards the sun and in front of me, silhouetted against the sun, was a lady who was holding the right hand of a little girl. As I caught them up, it was fairly evident the lady was probably the little girl's grandma. Overtaking them, they just seemed to be lost in each other's company because they were in deep conversation together. So you may ask, why do I call this a prophetic picture? Well, when I saw this picture, I felt the Spirit of God remind me of one of my favourite verses in all of Scripture from the book of Isaiah, chapter 41, verse 13, which says, For I am the Lord your God, who takes hold of your right hand and says to you, Do not fear, I will help you. Here we have, as Christians, an active word from the risen Lord Jesus saying that he is our God and that he takes hold of our right hand. Now, how do we get to experience this for ourselves? Simply by putting up our hand in faith for him to hold. But the most wonderful thing is it does not end there. For if we let him hold our hand, he goes on to say that we need not be fearful for whatever we are doing, he will help us. Now, going back to my picture, it seemed to me the little girl did not have a care in the world. She was feeling secure because her right hand was being held by her grandma as they walked and chatted together. She knew that if she wanted help, her grandma was there. Surely she's an example to us all. I have been a born again Christian for nearly 60 years. Jesus has been holding my hand all those years through the good and the bad times. And there have been some very bad times, but he has always been there holding my right hand. Sadly, I confess a couple of times I have done my own thing, but as soon as I put up my hand, he took hold of it again. So in these very difficult times of uncertainty, fear and loneliness, we need more than ever to let Jesus take hold of our right hand. Because if we do, his promise to us all is that we need not fear, for he will help us. How wonderful is that? Thank you for watching and may the Lord bless you. Amen.